In this video, we're going to be looking how to fix the problem if your septic tank is on someone else's property. So here are two houses connected to the same septic tank system. And in this instance, the septic tank is in the garden of the first house. And sewage and wastewater from both properties make their way down through pipes in the garden and then enter the septic tank in the garden of the first house. The wastewater then leaves the septic tank and is discharged into a soak away. So this is typically the basic setup of how a septic tank and soak away look and how they work. So what are the problems of being on a shared septic tank system? Well, basically it means that the landowner can dictate all the terms and conditions and this can cause many problems. For example, if they decide to get their septic tank emptied regularly or maybe they want to carry out repair work or maintenance work, maybe they want to get it serviced or maybe they even want to replace the entire septic tank and soak away system, then whatever they decide to do, as often as they want to do it, you're legally obliged to pay 50% of those costs. And there's many, many challenges with this arrangement of being on a shared system. For example, it could cause you to fall out with your neighbours. It can result in stress, anxiety. It can even result in court and legal battles. But here's the good news. I've made this video because I want to show you a really easy solution about how you can not only solve this problem, right, and save yourself thousands in unnecessary costs, but I'm also going to show you how you can put an end to all that stress and anxiety. It's really simple, and it'll take you and your builder just a few hours to do. Have a look at this. All you need is a septic tank and soak away kit. It really is that easy. First, dig a trench to the proposed location of where you'd like to put your septic tank. Then just dig the hole for the septic tank and then just dig the hole for the soak away. Next, insert the pipe into the trench that leads to the septic tank. Once you've done that, just insert the septic tank into the hole. I love these low profile septic tanks because they only take about 40 minutes to dig the hole and get into the ground. And on top of that, they don't need any concrete. Next, just insert the German inspection chamber. It just clunk clicks together. Then all you need to do is install the German aqua cells. They just slot together to create an aquifer or soak away for your septic tank. Once you've done that, connect a pipe from the German inspection chamber into the aqua cells and then just cover everything over with the German aqua gauze. You know, I really love these German soak away products because not only are they easy to install, but they also come with a 20 ton bearing load, which means they don't collapse and can be driven over. Once you've installed everything, simply cover over with soil. Last thing to do is just disconnect your pipe that goes to your neighbor's septic tank. Job done. You're now cut off from your neighbor's septic tank. They've got theirs and you've got your very own septic tank. No more problems, no more stress. For more information on these amazing septic tank and soak away kits, go to septictank.co.uk. Click on the septic tank and soak away kit image and it'll bring up a host of various septic tank and soak away kits that will cater for the number of bedrooms your property has. For more information, just click the link below this video or visit septictank.co.uk for free help and advice.